What's up, you two? Welcome to Wake and Bake with Uncle Hank. And I got my boy, my nephew, my brother, Jermaine, the big funny dude, aka Big Low Skin, the building. What's up, man? What's going on, man? Man, I'm chilling, man. I'm chilling, man. Yeah, chilling, 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 man. That's what's up, man. You know a lot. You know, been going on with the internet and stuff, man. You know, sure. a lot. You know, it's been a lot of stuff been said. There's been a lot of things that a lot of people don't know what they're talking about, and a lot of things that people think is real, but really is fake, though. Right, right, yeah, right. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Let's just jump right into it, man. I know everybody <laughs> been seeing it, man. Skinbone and T Sam. What? Hey, ass niggas deleted the whole season. So for the people that keep DMing me talking about it, and just a broke ass, bitch ass nigga that 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 was mad over some bread, deleted my shit that I paid for. What? Yo ass, stay out of the car, bro. Yo ass stay out of your manager Airbnb, bro. Yo ass is broke as hell. My just did a lot of broke, broke, dirty, bum ass shit. I ain't never did. I ain't never did nobody bogus. I ain't never played with nobody bread. I ain't never played with nobody money. You wanna play with me? Come on, bro. Stop it. Come call me, bro. Come on, bro. I'm broke because you not paying me. You owe me $5,000. Yes, I will be broke if you you own a motherfucker. You owe me that money. Pay me. Motherfuckers ain't had no camera. Nobody had no camera. No, no, none of my old cameramans had no camera. I was, they, everybody was using my shit. He said out his mouth that none of his cameramans never had a camera. Bro, if you know me, gang, I was shooting videos way before I was working with you. Shooting hella music videos, bro. I got a camera, bro. Like, stop playing with me, bro. Like, people would just say anything. You owe me $5,000, bro. 5000 nigga. Ooh! Hey, listen, man. Hey, listen, man. I know, look, them both of my brothers, let me say this first. You know what I'm saying? I know all y'all know that. We all work yeah, together sure. and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? That's bro. Shout out to Bone and T Sims. Um, shout out to Bone and T Sims. Um, what, 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 what you think, man? What you think going on, man? What you got? <laughs> man, look, I, I, I. Hey, it is what it is. You see, it's right there on the internet, man. You know, yeah. uh, I, me personally, yes, I usually don't get in people' business, but you know what I'm saying. Since the mess is out there, let's talk about it. Uh, <laughs> uh, Bone, you my boy. You know what I'm saying. T Sims, you my boy. I actually been on Bone a little bit longer than T Sims. Actually, I met T Sims. But uh, it look like you wrong on this one, big fella. Oh, <laughs> it look like you might be a little wrong on this one. For real. Uh, I mean. I, 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 honestly, I understand both parties, though, mm -hmm. right? I understand both parties, but if it, if it's a, if we if we going off a of right and wrong, then for sure T Sam's not wrong. Um, uh, sure. Business is business, man. You know what I'm saying? Take care of that business. You gotta pay for that stuff that you owe, unless you have. See, see, that's why I'm being on I have building relationships with people. Because if I if I owe you something, but I can communicate with you by me owing you, you feel what I'm saying? It'd be a little bit more understanding to you versus me ignoring you or yeah. not or. Cause then you're gonna be like, oh, this man think I'm a goofy. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, think yeah. I'm a duck. Communication is everything. And I For think sure. just because of the friendship that those guys have, you know what I'm saying? I think they friendship way bigger than bigger than the money right now. Yeah, but at sure. the same time, business is business. But ain't no question. You know what I'm saying? And somebody is, you know, everybody wanna be compensated about their work, you know? Yes, sir. So everything that that friendship shit really go out the window when it do come to people money you know what i'm saying because everybody got bills everybody got so, situations you know what i'm saying so. just not one person like got a problem you know what i'm saying so that is a, that is a touchy situation man because that that's yeah that's that's five thousand dollars man Bro, so, so do you know exactly how the, this the situation initially started no I, I, I it was a skit it started as a skit right yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Like I don't really know. I don't really know, man. Initially, it started though, but yeah. it is crazy. But you see how, um, speaking of, you just said Beezy, but speaking of Beezy, <laughs> I see Beezy comment a lot. If y'all don't know who Beezy is, that's Super Kick. He be trying to. He was um, he was Skimbone X cameraman, cameraman. right before TCL. Yeah, for sure. And our cameraman actually too. Oh yeah, for sure. He was our cameraman for a little bit till yeah. uh till uh he What happened at the comedy show? 
I don't know. He said uh, I snaked him, but I don't you know. You snaked him? Yeah. Ain't nobody snake out, man. Okay. Stop telling everybody I snaked you. I did not snake you. All right, so all right. Well, let's just say you snaked him the first nigga. Let's just say that. Right, what about right. the second one? Right. That was him. If somebody say, all right, watch this, like they finna go to the car and get a gun, what y'all gonna do? Y'all gonna <laughs> wait and watch him go and get whatever he gonna get? <laughs> no, you can't no. to that car. You ain't finna say, oh, he gonna say, oh, watch this. They gonna walk past. Like somebody's finna, finna let you walk past and go to your car. Uh, <laughs> What's wrong with you, man? Yeah, I hit him. Knocked him right on out. He was knocked out for at least 10 minutes. He was longer than that. Yeah. Like 18. The, yeah. The, next, the, the crazy part, the next day, he apologized. Uh, <laughs> he was like, I was wrong. I was drunk. Yeah, I was wrong. Yeah, knock some uh, sense into it. Knock some sense dead into his hand. <laughs> I won't, oh, won't, 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 won't. So, so what, BZ and T Sims, they, like, what, what, they got something going on? Um, I think, first of all, T Sims to work with who we want to work with. For so, sure. Uh, what's it called? BZ cool, he cool, or whatever, you know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. It's just crazy how, you know, when, you know, when somebody that don't like somebody, like, he don't like skin bones. So when he saw, um, uh, T Sims yeah. and skin bone into it. Oh, he started snapping like immediately like, want to click. Like, like, oh yeah, I got a click. I got I got a click. You know what I'm saying? That's how you know. You know what I'm saying? Dudes be cowards, man. That's how you know that. Like man, I'm looking for help. Like it's just like somebody just all loud. Like why you so loud? Just come over here. Why you gotta be so loud? Check it out. Check you know it out. what I'm saying? Like, you ain't got to handle this over here. You doing all that, boy? Let's get crazy. You know what's crazy? Well, I think it's the craziest part of the whole situation with Bone and T Sims is the fact that they actually went to the internet. Now, it, I, now I was watching Bone and I heard Bone mention that. Um, yeah, he ran to the internet with it. Woo, 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 woo. Somebody told him like, get off the internet. But I did see Bone on that first talking about it. He just ain't name drop. Right. I just, I saw I did I saw T Sims post first, but he was just saying basically he don't want to work with Skimbone. He no longer work with Skimbone no more. He no longer doing the twenty verses, and I wish everybody will. Like wait, so uh, wait, wait, so T Sims, you seen T Sims post it first? I saw T Sims post on his that story? first. Yeah, before that, I don't know if it was just came up first, but then I saw Bone. Oh, you know wow. what I'm saying? I saw Bone with it like get disrespectful to him, but I didn't even know what was going on. At yeah. I just saw like man, niggas stole my camera, broke shit. I'm like, damn, what's going on? And then when I saw T Sam drop it, it started coming together with me. I'm like, oh, okay, okay, okay. Cause everybody been really working. We ain't yeah. really been around each other like that. You know what I'm saying? We really been sure. everybody's just been doing their own thing. If y'all know we've been on tour, been doing, for you sure, know, for sure, for sure. doing our stand up comedy and all that stuff. And you know, everybody's just been having motion. You know, they own the motion, but we still that's still gang though, you for sure, ain't no question. For real, ain't no question. Uh, it's I, it's kind of crazy because I, I got a I got a relationship with both of them, yeah. and uh, me and Bone, you know, I rotate with him. You know, say so he be doing his thing. You know, I, you know, what I'm saying shout out to him, he, he creative or whatever the case may be. Sure. Humble, the humble person. Um, I didn't expect this type of energy from with T. Sims because T. Sims, I rotate with T. Sims. T. Sims a cool dude. Like, he's super sure. humble. Like, you know what I'm saying? He, he His work is some good. Uh, and he don't even do this. T. Sims hey. quiet. If hey. you know T. Sims quiet, super real, humble. observant. Sure. You know sure. what I'm saying? Chilling. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And he oh. actually will help you too, though. Like, when you like sure. you got a brain fart on an idea, he, yeah, he'll be he'll throw some creative ideas out there mm -hmm. to you, you know what I'm saying, to assist you. So, so with this, I think, like, both of them are some some good dudes and, and with this uh, situation, they could have definitely handled it a, yeah. lo a, lo a, lo a lot more right. better than this. Right. I want them to get, I really want them to get it together. I hope he just, you know what I'm saying, get it together because I think, you know, me personally, I think, you know, Bone, you know, not necessarily need him because there's a lot of cameramen, but the relationship is For more sure. bigger than the For business sure. of it. And it was, you know, the work ethic was crazy, you know. And I know he's not lying about how he was working because Bone yeah, yeah. is a workaholic. For you sure. Know you know, For Bone, sure. he, he own it, he want it, he, he own it, he own it, he own it, you know what I'm saying? So, which it ain't wrong, you know what I'm saying? Cause, but sometimes you just got to find somebody with that same work ethic as you sometimes, you know what I'm saying? But yeah. at the same time, he had the work at it. Yeah, I was just gonna about, say T Sims really. He got the work though. at it. Yeah, but it's just about the money. Yeah, it's about the five thousand. Ain't no question it's about the money because yeah, I know that's, that's been a lot of times where T Sims would come out and I could see T Sims like tired, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, uh looking like he ain't had no rest and whatever and be like, Man, I've been working fourteen hours, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? I'm tired, but 
He said he got this, so let's go ahead and knock this out. And, and yeah. it it was a couple times he did kind of like mention the saying like like um like damn I ain't gonna lie, motherfucker overworking, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> overworking, but <laughs> for real, for sure. And, and I mean I don't know if it, if it ever like was out there, but whatever the case may be. So I know he was actually working. He was working more than Beezy. Yeah, hell, he's yeah. working more than Beezy for sure. Beezy I tell you that. Lazy, and then Beezy gonna say on his podcast, he say he never, we never gave him fifteen thousand. We never gave him fifteen hundred. I mean, fifteen hundred before. Not at one time because you was nipping off of it all through the month. Boy, Let me get two hundred here. Let me get 300 I'm here. I'm on my wrist. Hit my phone off. Man, oh, my mama crazy, man. Then look, one time, nigga told me the phone was off. He needed some help. I threw him. I gave him. I'm like, oh, I'm going to give you 300 now. Go ahead and take care of what you need to take care of. Right. You know what I'm saying? They just know the ex going to come up off that move when that day come. Yeah. He all right, cool. Three days later, he still using his phone off Wi-Fi. What the hell you do with the 300? Man, that man be lying, man. And he stank, too. Be yeah. musty. Yeah. Real musty. Yeah. Go in his house. Smell it. You can smell must and the L, man. And a cat, and a cat. Yeah, and a cat, cat man. And then, you know what I'm saying? The, the going to the bathroom, it's like it haven't been tampered with. Tub haven't been tampered with no, at all. Sure. At all. Yeah. And he got radiators in his house. I don't <laughs> like people with radiators in the house. If you got, if you still got radiators in your house, don't invite me over there. But, but mama, I'm about to burn my ass right. trying to sit down. <laughs> it's April. The heat's still on. You got to wait on the landlord to cut it off. Nope. Uh, Get me up at this motherfucking apartment right now, please. Man, that is so funny, man. I swear to God, man. But yeah, man. But I really hope, man, at the end of the day, I hope T Sims and um, Bone get it together. And if they don't, shit, I just hope both of them, you know what I'm saying? I know both of them just still going to continue to elevate. You know what, what I'm saying? What if they actually box? Who you got your money on? I don't got my money on nobody. <laughs> I'm, I'm just going to buy tickets to fight. I'm just going to buy tickets to it and be fresh as hell so I can see uh, it. Boy, I better get in free, boy. Like, yeah, I want to see it. I want to see it. Like, man, they crazy. Man, so. Yeah, but, yeah, man. All right, so moving along, man. We got this new, uh, what's it called? Uh, Sunshine Coast Gang. Yeah, 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 Sunshine Coast Gang. You know, you know me. I, I I respond a lot to a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? That say my name. You know what I'm saying? Like A B B Z the uh, Love City Trenches, whatever they uh the podcast is that weak ass podcast. But yeah, like <laughs> it's like it's like they say. I was watching it right, and I watch it. You know what I'm saying? I give them they view. You know what I'm saying? So. He say, yeah, I'm doing good, like, in real life. Like, in real life, my life is not like the internet. Like, my life is the it, real life. Who's that? Um, Dre, Love City Dude. Okay. And I'm like, I'm looking at him like, what you think my life fake or something? Like, you think that I'm, like, like I've been fucked up or something? Like, no, nah, I had a career before this. Like, I was, like, I think you just need to, like, really know me and shit. Like, really, you don't... You don't really know. You don't really know me. Wait, so he made that? a statement and said like his his life bench. Like right? his life, yeah. Like I'm good. My life, like I, the internet, is like fake. Like our life, fake. Like what we doing is like really like a facade. Like man, if the internet go down, it's over with. You know what I'm saying? What the bam? Like they can just they gotta. I'm like, I'm like what, bro? Like. It's just a lot of things that people don't understand, you know what I'm saying? And don't forget that I'm a stand-up comedian before the internet, you know what I'm saying? Before the, and before and, the and you could go on there and see that we actually book. Like, right. book. we ain't book. just in Other Chicago city. doing uh, right. birthday parties and backyard parties. We don't right. even do that. We so, we, you know, right. we passed that. Yeah, yeah. We, yeah. So, I'll yeah. tell you some numbers on shows, but right. I'll be doing too much. But, but um, yeah. A lot of people was always, you know what I'm saying, like with, with the story with A.B. Shout out to A.B., first of all. We're not into it or none of that. We're just addressing things because y'all just take things out of content. And For sure. be like, oh, my God, what the band. So, like, the the thing with, like, with A.B., everybody be wanting to know, like, what's going on with A.B. I always tell people, like, yeah, if it wasn't for A.B., I would have never met. We probably you know what I'm saying? It probably wouldn't have been no Uncle Hank Big Lowdown because sure. I met him through A.B. For sure, no I question. always give him credit. Credit for it. For sure, no question. But it's like, um, I want to just address this one thing, right? Because he was like, on the podcast, A.B. was like, um, man, I never stole no joke. No joke, not no jokes. We talking about a skit. We talking about skits now. And he was like, "What?" And he was like, um, "We had said he stole the Foot Locker joke. I yeah. mean, the Foot Locker skit that you had for sure. That's one of them. With. For sure, it's one of them. You know what I'm saying? That's one of them. But 
this the I really want to talk about that one because I remember this day vividly. And you was at work, I think I was at work, but yeah. and it was the pandemic and B, uh, AB had the Foot Locker jersey. For sure, he had they, the Foot Locker. They went shirt. looting. They went right. looting. They went stole Foot Locker jerseys foot locker. out of Foot Locker right. instead of the shoes. <laughs> yeah, right. So they stole the, the Foot Locker. So Jermaine was like, "Look, we gonna see your shoes out the car with the Foot Locker jerseys For on. Sure. We out the bam. We out the bam." Mm -hmm. He went on here and did it. He went out with Stilo. Stilo and did it. Yeah. He say he didn't do that. He said, he was like, no, nah, that's a lie. I never did that. He was like, I'm the one. And then on the, you know, AB a little, you know, a little, you know what I'm saying? His elevator don't rise all the way to the top. So he was like, when they asked him, like, did you still escape? Like, I'm the one got the shirts. I'm the one got the shirts. I'm like, he studied saying he got the shirts. Yeah, we, we never know. said you ain't get the shirts. You got the shirts. <laughs> Nigga, you got the shirts. We know so, that. But the skit idea, and then when you called him, uh, when you, when you, um, uh, when you called him and told him about it, what happened? I told him about when I called him and told him about the skit from in the beginning. When, when it was out, no, when it was. Oh, when, when I was like, "Damn, bro, out. you gonna do the video without me?" Mm -hmm. He told me, "Man, I was just trying to get Stilo out of my way." I was, he kept asking me to do a video, so I just went on and did a video with him. I, why my idea? <laughs> why my idea, though, man? I swear to God, you could have found another idea and did it. And he got mad. Yeah, he got mad. He got mad. I hung up and everything. <laughs> Because because he did it he did it to me two times before I actually addressed the situation I actually did I actually before I even addressed the situation I let it go like you know what uh, you know what I'm gonna let it go because I'm creative enough to come up with another idea come up with another idea and once he did it the second time I'm like no nah, I gotta say something to him about this you know what, right, what I'm saying right. so I mentioned it to him. He nah, you know what I'm saying? That's what that's what the Stilo stuff. And then it was like, all right, okay, cool. Then another time come around was another video where I was telling him about the blunt rolling, about you eating ass and all that. He on my daddy, I swear to God, the very next day he did that video with him, Marquita, and Stilo. <laughs> right. And I think what you supposed to do that with Tashana. Yeah, exactly. And then <laughs> right. I called you and told you, I'm yeah. like, I see how you threw that out there. Yeah. Hey, look, I, I called you and told you about it. I'm like, man, I'm done with Yep. You immediately was like, nah, bro, we brothers, just talk about it, tell yep. him. And then if you know you can't do it, stop giving me your ideas. Just do it with him. When if you ain't gonna film it, don't say nothing about it. Facts. I'm all right. And then it happened again. It happened again. And then he was like, man, forget y'all. He was like, forget y'all. Fuck y'all, nigga. Oh, my mama, nigga. Fuck y'all. I don't need y'all. He definitely said. That's what he, he said. said. That's and what then we stopped fucking with him. For sure. That was it. Like, and that. And then now he like, he on his internet saying like, I would do you, bro. I would never walk away from my brothers. Woo -woo. I would never tell my brother, fuck you. I would need you. I don't, I don't need you. you. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. I'm it don't matter. Do it. Yeah, I can, I can stand on my own without bro. He can stand on his own without me, but that's still at the same time. I don't care what we got going on. We right. still get through this and we still work. We right. don't be all that beakering and all that. If it's a problem, we, we know how to talk about it. All right, we're talking about it. I ain't never going to be like, bro, I don't need you. I don't need no motherfucking uncle with no son. Oh, that's not right. what that's not how I'm thinking. I'm thinking like, hey, look, let's do it together and hopefully this can get a bigger. You know what I'm saying? I, I right. ain't on that. Come on, that's how you be with your. If you call him your brother, you gonna ride with him like your brother. I'm not gonna tell my brother or uh, somebody I'm genuinely giving my heart to. Fuck you, I don't need you. I'm not gonna tell nobody. I'm not gonna tell you that ain't nobody coming to see you. You weren't trying to be funny when you said that, man. You really felt like that. Yeah, it was that's that, what it was. That was true. And then shit, we got to working more, and he wanted to ride bikes. Oh, For sure. He wants to ride them damn bikes all the time. For sure. I'm pretty sure Love City know. Dre ass know. Yeah, he Dre know. He got up with AB and he playing, AB playing no motherfucking game. Yeah. He, did, he know that. He know He know what the fuck going on. They, them motherfuckers sitting around, they know. And I'm going to tell you something about too, that little light-skinned boy that's on y'all thing, man, with them dreads, man. I don't know you either, man. So just just, just be cool, man. I don't know you, man. For real. He said know, something to me? Man, he just be, you know what I'm saying? He just says little stuff and then... You know, Tree, the motherfucker that's paralyzed and got shot at the motherfucking Halloween party. Yeah, see, I used to, I was just messing with you. Yeah. I was that messing was, with that's you. That's your man. I ain't gonna lie, Tree. I was that's rotating with you. Man. But I ain't gonna lie, for you kind of rubbing me wrong now, man. With mm -hmm. the with the with that shit fake, bro. That is not real. That's not legit. That's not. That ain't a hundred. Mm -hmm. And then at the end of the day, on some real shit, nigga. I remember when you was, you was trying to do videos and you reached out to me to do videos and. Everybody else wasn't even really trying to work with you for real, gang. The only one that actually worked with you was corporate because he looked at it as an opportunity. You when I you when you reached out to me and I seen you working, I'm like, 
I'm going to work with a nigga that's working. So let me go on here and do it. Then I brought you around. Everybody, now everybody, we doing videos with you. And we okay do videos with you. And you started expecting more out of the people that was around. Like if they was your homies. I brought you around them, gang. So it's really, I'm the only one saying, yeah, hey, look, hey, I could be your homie. I'm your, phone. I'm your friend. You need me. Holler at me. Whatever the case may be. Then for you to go with some people that you know I don't coincide with. And then while they sneak this in me, you kind of like in the background ad libbing. You know what I'm saying? That ain't one hundred, my nigga. And I ain't never did nothing, nothing food to you. Mm -hmm. and when you got shot in my pocket, first of all, I didn't personally, per personally invite nobody. You get what I'm saying? It was a public invite, right? I hate that it happened. Mm -hmm. Then you came out, it happened to you. I went and seen seven people in the hospital. Seven people, right? Okay. Only because I only had. Like, reach to these seven people. You were one of the seven people. I actually sent you twice, buddy. You feel me? And you still act like it was nothing and start sneaking. Yeah, niggas don't even fuck with me. Like, I'm supposed to slide up here every day. Gang, if I got locked up right now for a pipe, you wouldn't write me a letter. <laughs> so stop it, bro. Like that shit, bro. I don't like that, bro. That shit ain't no hunting shit. So I'm going to fall back off niggas, like, for sure. Yeah, for sure. I, just, I just felt like, I'm like, man, I don't know you. I'm like, as soon as he was saying that shit, I'm like, bro, I don't know you. I got shot. Everybody got shot. You ain't on the motherfucker with problems. Like, I don't know you. So yeah. you ain't talking to me. Yeah. Like, I'm, like, I ain't even called you out. I never called you. Yeah, don't got sure. my number. I did like two videos, which you know, was off the strength of Jermaine. For sure. I really, you know what I'm saying? You know how I'm, so don't and, even please. And no cap, no cap. You know what I'm saying? I still was rocking with you up until you start, like, uh, with the ad lib and with, and you see Beezy sneak this to me. You know what I'm saying? You see uh, whoever else sneak that man, you ride the bandwagon with him at the same time. In the beginning, you said, I ain't getting in it. Then you start throwing little shit in there like, yeah, that's what come on. Or even if you was shooting that, bro. You know what I'm saying? At the same time, you know the platform, though, gang. It is what it is, though. A lot of, at, at the end of the day, I don't wish no bad shit on none of y'all. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, success going to be right there for me regardless because I'm going to work for it. I'm going to work for it. I had a platform. We had to build a platform, gain 600,000 followers in less than 10 months, bro. Niggas out here been doing this for like... Seven years and, and, and just now getting 500,000. Mm -hmm. And it ain't even really about no followers because we really looking for that paper, though. We monetized on every app. Like, every app has an income. Every right. app has an income. Oh, every app have an every. If the app don't got an income, I don't want it on my phone. <laughs> on the real, I don't know what y'all be talking about. Like, y'all be, y'all numbers be crazy, like, confusing. I don't even think shit. I don't even think damn one of y'all can pay on no platforms. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not, I'm not counting no money, but I'm not counting niggas' pockets, but since y'all. I want to talk about it like stop it man for real stop yeah. it man I'm you know, like 10,000 in a weekend from a stand up comedy for sure so it's like and that ain't the app and that Trey. ain't the app or none of that shit you know what I'm saying that's real life thing you know what I'm saying and, and you know y'all just gotta know what y'all talking about too. for real man for I, real and I'm gonna put this out there I ain't never can't nobody say that they seen me unless I was joking or he and ha ha on the plan like I always do you can't never say I went to the internet with a problem that I had with somebody. I've never did that. Nope. I've I, never did it. I, I did. He see he gonna do it because he he like he get a kick out of it. Yeah. Me personally, it be a more so a personal thing with me. I'm more so of a, let me holler at you right fast, bro, so I can feel your energy. I want to feel your. I want to look you in your eye when we having this conversation because at the same time, everybody don't need to know what we got going on, brother. You feel me? What we making it public for? So if I got a problem or issue with somebody, I'm not going to the internet and being like, oh yeah, you bitch ass niggas want to play unless it's a joke. I'm gonna tell you that right now. So if I got an issue with you. I'm on, on my kids, on my, we're gonna be standing face to face having this conversation. And the only way the conversation gonna go so is if I see you nervous. If you got some type of ump or a tip on your shoulder, we're gonna go all the way there. And that's just how it is. Yep. That's just how it is. And it's, and it's uh, for the record, why I say there's no beef. This is no beef. It's just us simply addressing it. For sure. On for sure. Because yeah. it know, ain't no beef for nobody. I ain't the two of nobody. Right. Because I'm not coming on y'all platform. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they going to yeah. pay me. I'll go. Yeah, yeah. They're going to pay me, love, ass. Y'all yeah. ain't got no goddamn subscribers or nothing. Send, that. send that money. I'm not doing that. Send me that, send some that money. money. Send me what I'm worth. Love ass For sure And uh You know what I'm saying Talking about some He gave me enough money I couldn't even buy a sandwich With that money he bought It was Who 75 said that? Off. Who said it Oh uh, Trey man Talking about some man The money that I get You what know you what I'm saying him? Say like, dollars for what? For a video. I ain't the video that has uh say my you look cow what I'm Uncle Hank. Yeah. Yeah, and I think that's the biggest numbers on your channel right now. That's <laughs> you got I you got paid twice. Fucking numbers on your channel. And I don't think he even got monetized. Oh he ain't monetized. But I also wait, so hold on, wait, so also you only paid him $75 for the video? 
Yeah, I ain't had no money. I, I wasn't, you know, I was, bro, I was working a job. I was when I was working then. Well, he you know told you, you uh, give me what you got? Yeah. And then what you call, say, uh, 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 Bree, Beezy say I was in the house mad, broke. You was in the house, man. Yeah, that never happened to me, boy. And since you know me, I had my crib and everything. Nah, <laughs> on my mama. I'm sure know that. Like, I, I, ever since you met me, I had my own crib. Ooh, my I want to go there. That's crazy. See, I'm I like, wanna... nah, I've never been in the house. Money don't make me depressed, boy. I, I'm, I'm folk on awesome. I ain't going to lie to you. I got Let me put this out there. It ain't, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't had nothing to do with me, but I'm going to address something. Exactly. Right. The day the situation happened, where the incident happened at the at the comedy show, we had the comedy show, two sold out shows at Riddles that day. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I called BZ personally and said, BZ, you coming out to work because I wanted him to vlog so we can make some more money the day we making some money. Right? Oh, yeah. And, his response was, I don't really know. I'm like, damn, what you mean you don't know? Oh, yeah. He, man, shit. I'm like, bro, I know you ain't finna say nothing about no money. He like, shit, they don't fucked up, bro. I'm like, bro, why we talking about money? Like, we ain't going out here to make money. This is, how we, this is the way for us to make money right here. Right. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, you ain't got to worry about what you worry about, what, what you need. He, no, no, I'm, I'm going I'm to see. So I'm like, you don't force yourself if you ain't got the energy for a gang. It's cool, you know what I'm saying? Don't do it. When I know for sure, I just, I know for sure, I just came out my pocket personally just a few days before this and looked out for you. But I left it alone. I ain't whatever the case may be. He I pulled was up. Mad. I was mad. He was, you was front. He pulled up to the show, right? Not ready to work. Drink, drunk off uh, Cavassier or whatever uh, he was drinking. Uh, uh, Ansat, uh, Crown Royal, whatever he be drinking that cheap shit. Uh, he in there. Coming there twisted, didn't didn't have no didn't have no plans on actually working, and then he actually started working. But for for you to address somebody saying like, oh, he was in the house upset or mad because he ain't had no no funds, nigga, I witnessed you plenty of times act like you ain't want to come outside because you ain't have it. Mm -hmm. and, and, and 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 that's just I'm just that's that's what it is. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The man, the man, the man, the man a coward. Ain't no question. I don't like him. You know what I'm saying? I don't like him. You know what I'm saying? He cool though, but he not he cool. Like, he he cool. not cool. I don't like the coward of the man in him. He not I'm cool, saying? and I usually don't even do it. He not cool. I ain't gonna act like he cool. On my mind, it's a different yeah, type. I of... forgot all about that though. That's one of the reasons why I really was mad too, because yeah. Barry ain't performed that yeah. day, and he was playing with that coward. He never yeah. recorded us, nigga. You was on our payroll, and you followed Skimbone around like you was on his payroll, and T Sims was already there working for him. On the real, and you was for surely gradually moving out. out yeah. of his way and yeah. you, you ain't even know you was that mad crazy and then and, 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 and nigga you can't say you can't you can't say nothing bad about me nigga I've always been a hundred nigga fuck you talking about nigga can't, can't say nothing nothing bad about me and I'll go there I ain't gonna lie to you I'm my mama I ain't gonna lie to you Beasy make me wanna go there I was leaving that alone at first but he makes me want to go there the way he move and the way he act because I went out to shoot a, a short film with uh, police I'm on the phone I say look watch when I pull up this nigga gonna phony kick it with me. <laughs> I say he's gonna phony kick it with me. Soon as I pulled up and jumped out the car, he what's up, y'all doing all that? Well, I'm having a conversation with him. You do content. She told me you charge her five hundred dollars to shoot her movie. I say, alright, look, this is how I'ma do it. Since I seen you charge her five hundred dollars to shoot it and edit it, this is what I'ma do. I'ma pay you, I'ma pay you seventeen dollars an hour to film. And then on top of that, I'ma give you five hundred to edit it. Hmm. He was like, all right, bet as it go, just give me the days. And nigga, two days later, he unfollowed all us. <laughs> that weird as hell. Well, I say, gang, you could have just said that right then and there. You not on that. Hey, I ain't gonna lie to you. I thought about working, whatever the case may be. I'm just, I'm gonna just sit this one out. <laughs> that's, that's it. You say, yeah, you down. Two days later, you unfollow everybody. Come on, that is weird, man. That's weird. <clears throat> and on it ain't about the follow. I don't care about that. It's, it, it, it's a follow gang. It ain't no money. But I'm just saying I'm having a conversation with you, and you telling me one thing but feeling another type of way. That ain't a hundred, nigga. It weird. That ain't a hundred. That's why you see someone, me and OJ had all that thing. Who found the video? And we who all mess with these? For sure. They gonna go and click up with. With all of the, 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 they gonna just click up. They gonna click up hard as hell, man. I know, I know Hank can't be duplicated. <laughs> I know, you know, that I'm one of a kind. I'm one of a kind. Hey, y'all hate it. You can't, you can't steal it. Yeah. <laughs> you can't, you can't do it. Yeah, for sure. So, 
With that being said, with all due respect, man, kiss my ass, man. <laughs> yeah. That got a bump on the <laughs> uh, two bumps on it. <laughs> it can't be duplicated, though. For real, though. It, Uncle Hank Big Lowdown can't be duplicated. For sure. And um, I think they just mad at it. And if a nigga was, you know, if they wanted they feeling so much, he could have just been on board. And, you know, stay with it. And don't quit it. And you got to get it, but. Crazy part about it is everybody that sneaked this and was actually on board. Mm -hmm. And and you could tell that that look, whatever they doing ain't really working. That's why they gotta click up with so many people to, to be against yeah, to be against right. the brand. And the crazy part about it is our brand ain't even declining, gang. That's just the crazy part about it. I heard him say, I heard him say, uh, yeah, they Uncle Hank with this this my sister house ain't been the same since I was filming it. All right, let me, let me say this. I'm going to take oh, my hat off yeah. to you right fast. I'm going to give you your flowers, right? You are an awesome uh, and a creative uh, videographer. Bro. I give you that. You I'm not going to take that from you. you You're dope. That's why I gave you the opportunity to actually work with the actual with the brand, right? You, you dope. I'm going to give you that. I can't take that from you, all right? But what I am going to tell you is, Gang, we learn to do that. Dude, sit right here in front of and edit all that shit by itself. And you still getting hundreds and thousands of views, man. <laughs> and them checks still come every still month. Come they still every come month, every month. Every month. And I think when you left, we had like a hundred and some thousand subscribers. Now we got damn near 400k subscribers. Oh, for sure. That, that, that means mean it's going up. It's not going, it's not declining. It's going it's up. Not going it's down. like going up. It's like this is still like right. that way. So, so like you know <laughs> I can honestly say with a positive heart when I really don't say this though I can honestly say in my heart man I don't need y'all I don't need you I don't need you for sure I don't I, I don't need you man for real I do I need you I'm gonna say this right now before you go I need you I need you to leave me the hell alone that's what I need you to do oh, oh, oh. I'm you. cool. Leave me alone, man. Y'all need me more than I need you. That's why y'all that tell us. Come on, you can come on here. Come on, I podcast. No, pay me, man. I need. Give me fifteen hundred, man. I'll send my motherfucker for out. Yeah, uh, for 15, sure. Give me fifteen hundred, man. Seven fifty deposit, man. For real. For sure, for sure. Send it to me. That's all y'all can do, man. Y'all got money. Y'all heard the money. Y'all getting that um. Y'all get that non for profit money. You get that non for profit money. Whatever. For sure. For sure. <laughs> you get that for sure money, man. For sure. For real, you getting that real, that real nine from private money. That's that real money. Yeah, your your life real. Everybody life, everybody else fake. Yeah, we living the internet life. You living just a, a real one. Yours real. I, I, yeah, I, yeah. Like you, you. He say, yeah, my real, my family's real. Like I, I got a real family. I got a real job. I got a real. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> like we got a fake family. Like my fake shit life. fake or something. Get your goof ass on, man. Real, bro. It's just TV, man. <laughs> hey, hey, no. real, man. He go, he need to go back to Homo Park with that shit, man. For real. Hey, look, I, I want to go back off topic, but I just something just went across my head, dog. What? Wait. Back to the bone and T Sims, huh? What? Why would bone and T? <laughs> Did T Sims say once upon a time, Kimbo said he can't have a girlfriend yeah. to work for him? Man, that, <laughs> man, that was crazy, man. Now when he explained it, he said, "I need y'all motherfuckers focused, boy. You can't get no ass." I'll tell you that right now, boy. No ass. I would have been like, no man, kids. No, no, no kids. You can't have no new kids around this motherfucker. You fired. I would have been like, damn, boy. I can't. I can't knock him. His criteria is great. Hey, look. Man, I mean, that's just, that's just some, right some people want who they want. Some people want who they want to work, work with. He just, and that was real. <laughs> he just let you know. He let you know that you know what I'm saying. <laughs> if you go work for him, you got to be open all day. Oka yeah. will call you three o'clock in the morning. Bitch, but, get up. But get this, up. But, get up, man. But this is what I want. This is what I want to put out there. He got a girlfriend and a baby. <laughs> <laughs> And then, hey, Bo did so, so he's like, I know what it is. That's his bitch in his head. <laughs> boy, that funny, boy. I hey. was like, man, my boy Bo is going crazy on this motherfucker, man. I was like, God <laughs> damn, man. Yeah, yeah. hey, they my dogs, though, man. For oh, real, they're, they're, they're my brothers, man. So, hey, look, though, shout out to my boy, uh, Byron Poe, too, man. He's going to be opening up this weekend at the We Are The Ones. Um, oh, so, yeah? Uh, yeah, with, with Mike, Mike Epps. Yeah, oh, Mike Epps going to bring them out. I really hope he did. That's good, big. Man. Um, um, yeah, man. That's a that's another thing. Stop stealing too, Byron. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not taking Excluded. up for that. 
yeah, yeah. I'm not taking up for that shit, man. <laughs> they was right with your ass. You know, stop stealing. We don't do that. We do original shit. Don't do that stealing shit, man. No, I, done, yeah. I done remixed the idea or kind of finessed the idea. You know what I'm saying? Nah, he did it. But hey, I'm not. Hey, I'm hey. not for the going there and do exactly the same thing. Uh, do for real. That a nigga did needed. So for real, yeah, man. Shout out to my boy Greg though too, man. Doing his thing, man. Greg got me dead. Yeah, Greg got me dead, man. Y'all go follow Greg on Instagram. Oh, Greg did some shit too, boy. What he do, boy? I ain't gonna be messy on the podcast, boy. <laughs> Greg did some shit too, boy. <laughs> y'all already know, man. Y'all go look at all his stuff on you, uh, Tubi. He got Tubi going crazy right now, and his YouTube go crazy too. But he the first one, I think. Shoot, he he the first one going crazy on the Tubi. Show. Oh yeah, out of out of, out of the content, out of the content yeah. side for sure, for right. sure. And he producing his own, he directed, he got everything. He ain't got that problem with them cameramans either. Yeah, no. No shade, no shade, Bone. Don't do me like that, for real. Don't do me like that, for right. real. You my brother, man. You know I love you. Crazy part mm. about it, uh, Beezy shot, help shoot uh, one of uh, Greg Films. Yeah, yeah, Beezy roll. Yeah. Beezy roll with that hand. He got and he, he re roll with the editing and shit, bro. Yeah, so. And I wanna uh they always be like uh they always be saying bone is the boss bone put us on. If it wasn't for bone, uh you know, A B said if it wasn't for bone, half of them niggas wouldn't even be on right now. Dang. I'm like he said that? Yeah, I'm like shit. I say thank you, Bone. Well, thank you, thank you for giving me the opportunity, and I beat it up and and, and went off, and I went crazy. Now I got a platform, putting niggas on, and went off where we play. Introducing Officer Big back and that man. Yeah, that's, I'm gonna say that. I'm gonna say that. Bone, bone platform definitely helped us. Hell yeah, yeah. It, it helped us with our brand and corporate. And, and, and corporate as well. But I'm gonna say this right now: if we wasn't working, we wouldn't be where we at, right? If we wasn't working, we wouldn't be where you at. Because you could do a video with. Anybody, but if you ain't working, ain't nobody hitting the follow button, ain't nobody right. subscribing, ain't nobody paying out to come and see you. So I'm gonna say this: uh, I rotate with Bone. Bone, we were uh, we was actually lit when we met. You know what I'm saying? We wasn't as our brand wasn't as big, but we was lit. We, we was, was working, working. We and was we was working. dropping, and we was coming, and everybody knew who Uncle Hank and Big Lowdown was. So when we started working with Bone, the relationship got so dope because everybody creative, everybody bringing something good to the right. table, everybody got this. So it's like, all right, okay, teamwork, make the dream work, let's go. So we, you know, what I'm saying we built a brotherhood, built a a team that actually is. I ain't gonna lie, it's real, real, I ain't uh, hands down, and I ain't saying this. No, no, I think our team Team together and all us 100%. We 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 the Bulls in 90. What the, what was the year? They, 93, 95. 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90. They was winning for sure. Yeah, 96 and all that. Yeah, yeah we we were, for sure. We were on the red. And if we and if we really really come together like really sit down at the table, boy, and go crazy, man, it will it'll be it'll be it'll be something different. And I think everybody know that. That's why that's why when they do bring us up, they bring us up at Skinbone, Uncle Hang, um, Big Lowdown, Rico. They always say everybody. Burn Pope, they'll say it that old because they know yeah. they know the team, and yeah, I think Uncle Hank won content creator of the year. Are you won that? What? What? Yep. The yep. Hunter Award? Yeah. Okay. Yep. Right. Congratulations to that. Congratulations yep. to that. Yeah, I, gave, I, gave, I, gave, I gave. I gave it to. I, I gave it to this hanging up gave, my yeah, I gave it to my sister, man. My sister here got it in the award, I think. Well, uh, dress a cap. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny, boy. On the real, though, man. You know what? I, I was something. It was just on my head, man. I swear to God, I hope I ain't just losing. Mm -hmm. That I wanted to just mention. Oh, okay, yeah. Let me say this to the uh, to the content creators that's out there, you know what I'm saying, that that uh, think that we in tour that we beefing or whatever the case may be. We uh, we not in tour. We ain't beefing, man. It is what it is, man. Right. I'm working, you working. That's what it is, man. Right. A lot of people be saying, like, man, why you don't fuck with? Ooh, 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 why I ain't see y'all doing no videos? Ooh. I'm working, man. I'm working. If I see somebody else working, I'm I I be right. I'm, I'm open. I'm writing. I'm doing all type of man, shit. Man, we didn't work with AB already. Anytime I call AB if I need him for something, yeah, like, for I'll sure. call him and be for like, sure. yeah, you'll be good for this role. I ain't gonna lie, AB funny. He can he he actually played some he came on my man where people couldn't even play the role and I'm like, damn, AB will be perfect for, for the role. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Sure. But sure. it wasn't like he was one to right, one one right. Because it's friction it's friction in the relationship. Right. Motherfucker see we all 
all respectful, but you know what I'm saying? And then they'll say, like, man, we'll tell somebody don't work. I never told nobody, man, don't work with them. Never. Don't work with them. Oh, you working with them? Ooh, don't work with them. You know what I'm saying? They've been very serious about it. Like, no, boy, I don't care if you work with them or not. You know what I'm saying? Like, it don't, it don't you know, matter. And ain't then, no mouth to be mad at you because you did a video with them, huh? Right. And there ain't no comedy beef. They be like, it's comedy beef. Wow. Like, so what, boy? Your ass be at McDonald's. Mad at your employees, right? Okay. Uh, or you mad at your coworker? You work at Walmart. Your ass be mad at your coworker, right? Y'all get into it. Y'all so stay mad at the beef. manager. Yeah. All right. They talking about comedy beef. So what? You a man? I'm a man. So what? We got beef. We got beef anyway. It's so funny. I just watched the Atheon Crockett in the video. The first thing how he opened up the skit it was, see the comedians beefing. So we finna be into it. Boy, I fell out, boy. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's so what, man? We can be into it. So sure, we can be into it. It don't matter. No, I'm just playing, but we can be into it in the right way, in the car, in the comedian way. I'm gonna get creative on your ass. I'm gonna get so creative and make something for something for you, man. Your kids gonna be playing it. You gonna be mad. Yeah. Cut it off. Why you don't like Uncle Hank, Daddy? Your kids love me, man. Yeah, right. <laughs> Like that be the messed up part about like it. Like how OJ did? Yeah. That be, <laughs> that be the messed up part about it with like, I'm talking about, it did, I'm talking about OJ's sister ran up to me and just hugged me, screwed, like, man, I love you. I love, I'm like, damn, this your sister, boy. Yeah. And you doing all this. <laughs> this your family, man. <laughs> your family. <laughs> hey, love, Hank, man. Who said that? Who? I thought rappers said that, bro. Yeah, man. I be like, man, Joe, y'all need to stop it, man, because you going to go on to my man, cut that off, man. So you going to walk in the house, all you going to, this is my sister's house. You Oh my well, God. I got to leave. <laughs> then you're going to have to, you can't block me, because if you do block me, somebody else sharing it, going down my your timeline. You know, follow me, it's on your timeline. Okay. So, you know, the fake page is busting. So, you know. Yeah, they got fake pages. Yeah, fake pages is even busting. So I just let them do it. I just let them do it. You know yeah, what I mean? Fake pages. I got, I got like three, four fake pages. Yeah, they got the right number up there. Email. I be like, man, fuck it, go ahead. Yeah, they put, at least they still promoting me. You know what I'm saying? At least they still. I just can't check the DMs, but at least right. they still promoting like, me. Damn, what the hell? But uh, man, this was dope, man. I just wanted to. Uh, we came over. We just, you know, talked our, popped our, you know, popped our shit. You know, say what we was gonna say, and um, I appreciate everything. Like we said, it ain't really no beef. It ain't no real beef, no real pressure like that. You know what I'm saying? Cause if it was pressure, bro, you feel me? If it was pressure, bro, bro, bro. If it was pressure, bro, so that, bro, motherfucker, bro, bro, it, bro. No, that's how them rappers be, right? <laughs> but y'all though, man, for real, man. I really appreciate y'all, man, from the bottom of my heart, man, for real, man. I really appreciate them. For sure. And uh. Love y'all for checking in, man. My name is Keith Brown, the comedian, a.k.a. Uncle Hank. And I'm Jermaine, the big funny dude, a.k.a. Big Lowski. And I appreciate y'all for tuning sure. in, man. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, man, and tell everybody, man, share to y'all pages and stuff. And let everybody know we talking high shit on here. Love, man. You already know what it is. We out. You, you say that at the every podcast? Yeah, love. You do like you literally You yeah. really do all I don't know why I say You know what it is What I be saying You know what it is But I don't even know What the fuck exactly. it is Exactly yeah. So whole time You going in Lying Yeah You gotta be much. honest When you come out Yeah And then you give them the lies Yeah Nigga got the camera Got the camera